It's raining here in Mongomo. Just a few minutes, just about 30 minutes after the Black Stars have won in dramatic fashion again against the opposition South Africa in the Cup of Nations to qualify for the quarterfinals. A fifth straight Cup of Nations quarterfinals for the Black Stars it is. Goals from John Boy and Andrea Yu have given Aaron Grant a very good introduction to African football again. And at the post-match press conference, the coach was speaking about the mental fortitude of the boys. And I asked him if he thought that his big players, his star players, are not coming to the party. He said, no, it's a team effort. And that Asamwajan came big in the first game um, that he played against Algeria. Andre Ayu has come well and good in this one. So he feels that his players are coming into the fray. He was also asked about Jordan Ayu and what a lot of people think is a loss of form or an, a bad appearance so far in the Cup of Nations. He says he's not going to judge any player right now, but he's going to wait till after the tournament and that he feels Jordan Ayu has played his part. Asamwajan also spoke at a press conference, said thank you to you, the Black Stars fans, for what has been an incredible group stage in the Cup of Nations. Sheikh Masaba also spoke uh, glowingly about his team, but he said that it's been hard luck. So that's all we have in terms of the group stages. Ghana are going to Malabo, the capital of Equatorial Guinea. It's a long flight over land and across the sea, but there'll be more updates. Tomorrow, definitely, the Black Stars will be having a post-match presser, and I'll be bringing you the updates from here. So from Mongomo, this will be, hopefully, our last session in terms of the AFCON video logs for City 97.3. Gary L. Smith here, signing out.